Hey second graders, welcome back. I'm super excited about today's lesson because we get to subtract from thousands, which I think is so cool because that's such a big number and it will look really impressive. And the cool thing is it's not even going to be harder because you already know what to do. The steps are all the same. You just might have to do one more step than normal, but you pretty much know how to do it already. So we're just going to dive right in. We are going to put a thousand, the top, oh, you know what? I need to write this bigger. Okay. One thousand. To write the number one thousand, you put a one in front and you do three zeros after it. Okay. One thousand, take away seven hundred seventy-two. And I just realized I did not label the T for thousands, I'm going to do TH for thousands, H for hundreds, T for tens, O for ones. I just want to make sure that we have all of our place values labeled. All right, just like normal, we are going to start in the ones place because we always start in the ones place. We're going to say our rhyme, say it with me. More on top, no need to stop. More on the floor, go next door, trade 10 more. Well, our next door neighbor has nothing to give us. So we're going to go next door, trade 10 more. Even our hundreds number has nothing to give us. So we're going to go next, next door. And we have a thousand there. We're going to cross off our thousand and trade it for 10 hundreds. Remember when we count hundreds, if we had hundreds blocks or hundreds flats that we were counting, we would count 10 of them to get to a thousand. So now we have 10 hundreds. That's great, but we still have nothing here in the tens place. So we're going to have to cross off one of the hundreds, break it apart into 10, 10 sticks. Now that's awesome, but there's still only a zero here in the ones place. So we're going to go next door to our tens place. We're going to ungroup a 10. So we had 10 10 sticks. We're going to ungroup one of them, which means we only have nine 10 sticks. And we're going to ungroup it into 10 ones. Now we have 10 take away two, which is eight. We have nine take away seven, which is two. We have nine, take away seven, which is two. And we have zero thousands, take away zero, which is nothing. So our answer is 228. Now I know that can be a little fast, so we're going to do another one. I'm going to quickly label TH for thousand, H for hundred, T for tens, O for ones. All right, let's do another one. We are working in the thousands place, so we're just going to write 1,000 here. And we're going to take away 526. Make sure when you are writing these numbers, that you are lining them up in the correct place. Notice I did not write my 500 over here in the thousands place because I said 500. It needs to line up. Your ones need to line up in the ones place. Your tens need to line up in the tens place. And your hundreds need to line up in the hundreds place. If you write your problem down wrong before you solve it, you will get the wrong answer every single time. So please make sure that you are lining up the place values correctly. All right, now we're going to start subtracting. And we always start in the ones place. Say the rhyme with me. More on top, no need to stop. More on the floor, go next door. Trade 10 more. My next door neighbor has nothing to give. Let's check out my hundreds place. My hundreds neighbor has nothing to give. Let's go to the thousands place. The thousands place is going to save us today. We're going to cross off a thousand and trade it for 10 
hundreds flats. Now we have 10 hundreds flats, flats, which is great, but we still don't have any 10 six and we still don't have any ones. So we need to break something up to get more. We're going to take one of those hundreds flats. We're going to ungroup it to make 10 10 sticks. That helped us out a little bit, but we still don't have any numbers in the ones place. So now we're going to take one of those 10 sticks and we're going to ungroup it into 10 ones. Now we have more on top. So we're going to do 10 take away six, which is four. We have more on top here. We have nine take away two, which is seven. We have more on top here in the hundreds place. We have nine take away five, which is four. Our answer is 474. We're gonna do another one quickly. I know that sometimes these videos can seem long, so I am trying to make them short. Once again, if you need to pause the video and slow it down and practice on your own, please do. All right, we have 1,000 take away 843. Always start in the ones place, friends. More on top, no need to stop. More on the floor, go next door, trade 10 more. Unfortunately, there's a zero in the tens place, so it won't work for us today. We need to go to the hundreds place. There's a zero in the hundreds place, so that's not going to work for us either. So we're going to go to the thousands. The thousands place will help us out because it always helps us out. So we're going to cross off our thousands and now there's none left. We're going to trade 10 over to the hundreds place. We have 10 hundreds, which is awesome, but we still have zero here in the tens and ones place. So now we're going to cross off one of those hundreds flats and ungroup it to make 10, 10 sticks. Now we have 10 in the tens place. We have nine in the hundreds place, but we still have zero in the ones place. And we have to start with the ones place. So we're going to go to the tens place and borrow. We're going to trade 10 ones over. We have 10, take away three, which is seven. We have more on top here, nine, take away four, which is five. We have nine take away eight here, which is one. Our answer is 157. 